Good morning. Today I'm going to share with you one of our food prep activities that we have in our toddlers class, in the Lily class. Um, it's an activity that gets used over and over again. It's a real hit. Um, the children love it. So just to explain what we have here, this is our citrus squeezing or our juice squeezing activity. Um, I've got two halves of a, a nachi. Um, it's much easier to use a satsuma or a nachi or what the shops call easy peelers. They're much easier for a toddler's hands to handle than a big orange. An orange is, is really big and they're quite hard. So I usually find that using a softer fruit like a nachi or a satsuma is much easier for a toddler to handle. So we've got two halves. I've got a little non-slip mat here with my um, orange squeezer, orange juice squeezer here and I've got a, a glass for the juice. So I'm just going to show the child first how to do it and then I'm going to invite them to have a turn. Obviously I've got my apron on and I'm going to invite the little child to put their apron on. Um, we will have already gone to wash our hands, our hands are clean, we've got our aprons on and now I'm going to show them how to squeeze some juice from the satsuma. See if we've got some juice. Juice. Would you like to try the juice? And I'll invite the child to have a little drink of the juice, and then I'll show the child where to throw the, the used peel. The peel goes in the compost bin. So we'll go together and we'll put it in the compost bin and then I'll invite your child to have a turn with the other piece of nachi. And then they may well want to go on for a long time. Obviously we only give them a certain amount of um, citrus fruit because we don't want them to have too much. But if they want to keep going they can always make a glass of juice for dad, for their sister, their brother at home. So if they love the squeezing, let them carry on. I hope you enjoy this activity and you can do it at home. <laughs> 